I grew up in a very, very tiny village called Qomikola in north of Iran. As a child, I didn't know even Amsterdam exists. My dream was just to, to sing, to dance, to ride a bicycle, to jump in the beautiful river in my village. But I was banned from doing all these activities just because of being a girl. I got myself into trouble from the early age when I actually said no to those who tell me what to wear, to those who tell me what kind of lifestyle to follow. I told women that if you want to be your true self, if you want to overthrow the dictators, first you have to actually start your own revolution from your family's kitchen. So make a video. I got bombarded by videos of women walking unveiled, waving their headscarves. And you have to pay a huge price to just be visible. I remember that um, one of the women who sent me a video, I said to her that if I publish your video, you're gonna go to jail. So I'm gonna blur your face. She said, don't. This is what Taliban and the Islamic Republic and ISIS do it to us. They want to make us invisible. So I am here to take my visibility back. The government arrests women who send videos to me. They arrest my brother. Oh my God, I got kicked out from my homeland. They want to make me feel guilty. Sometimes they get successful. I was actually thinking to shut down the campaign. But immediately I received videos from mothers whose children got killed, whose children got arrested and long prison sentence. They were the ones saying that now we are the voice of our daughters. Now we are the voice of our sons. These are all scary, but I don't have any fear. For me, the most scariest thing in the world is just that the whole world is watching, that the Iranian regime is killing innocent teenagers killing innocent women and men. So I should not feel guilty. Those who lashes people should feel guilty. Those who kill people must feel guilty. Those who execute people must feel guilty. So I was successful to overcome my guiltiness and be the voice of Iranian brave heroes inside the country. My name is Masih Ali Nejad. I'm an Iranian woman. And my goal is to overthrow a gender apartheid regime in Iran, in Afghanistan, and go back to the Middle East, hug my mom and my women and my people. <laughs> 